Alright, it is I, Grimsight. I've returned to play some more Final Fantasy. It's been a couple days, so it hasn't been too long for this. I did play um, the start of The Last of Us 2 this morning. Just to kind of get that out of the way for K. Just for her to watch. Um, do I remember what really happened? No, I remember taking down Garuda. Which is the wind chick, Benedictus, Benedictress, whatever her name was. And now her lover, the like Titan dude, is really upset. And mind you, she was also sleeping with Odin, so <laughs> I don't really like her all too much. I don't understand how other people. So yeah, we gotta keep the dad. I did all the side quests, that's what we did. Well, 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 someone's in a hurry. Just following orders. Funny, I never took you for the type. Can't all be as obedient as you, Gav. Eh? <sighs> Fine day for a little mischief, wouldn't you say? Is this all of us? Actually, Gav won't be coming. <laughs> Just not? the three of us, then. He looks like he did want to. Like said, is the keystone of the Empire. Oriflam's in chaos, yes. But that doesn't mean we can march an army through her gates. The fewer our numbers, the better our chances of going unnoticed. And should that plan fail, well, we have our icons to fall back on. Here's why Gav doesn't, or why See we that. shouldn't bring Gav. I don't know if I can. If Reed still seems to come and go as he pleases. Ordinarily, Prime and Icon. Your team will be joining us dominance. later. When I called him before it started, he no said that he was just dominance. starting his shower. Well, he still got the blessing of the Phoenix, doesn't he? Not to mention what he sucked out of Garuda. And did I ever tell you about how he was once the greatest shield in Rosaria? You know, I reckon he could probably cause a path out of the capital on his own if need be. Let's try not to find out. Well, that's <laughs> likely to be spotted. He knows a lot about me, seven. apparently. I'll meet you in Northreach in a few days. You two behave now. I did start a little bit later than I planned, but when the Zero Team gives me time. Shows up late, what do you expect? Still started earlier than he did. <laughs> We get for taking a shower. He said he just got home. So, and he was we're meeting in jumping North in the shower. But will I find Sid and Jill before this dame finds me? Which means that his errands took way longer. But how did the one. grocer know his daughter had been stealing off to the vineyard to see the lad? I think it's because he was hanging out with Rock for right? I don't remember. I remember he said that he had to go do something. I remember with who. Is it safe to ride to Northreach now? Did we get to ride chocobos in this game? I forgot. Uh, so just now I started The Last of Us posting their video on YouTube. So I think it took about. <laughs> 13 hours to beat. So not too long of a series. That means like immediately start the next game. Or uh or uploading the next game. But we'll see, because I mean the last of us 13 episodes, that sounds about right. That's what you want. So then, let's see. Got a lag. I want to make sure that it was just the web player. Um, we have Last of Us, Batman Season Two. 
The Last of Us Part 2. This game. That all needs to come out on YouTube. Sandland has already officially started. Or. Uh, has no already like, been way through. <laughs> Kakarot got officially started. That's what I wanted to say. Might be because this is downloading actually. I think so. This is what I need. Swift recovery. Down, downward, downward thrust is okay. I should just get all of this. Maybe not. Huh? One twenty rook gambit. I dislike that. And this seems bad. Claims of rebirth is crazy. It's like my go to ultimate. So for like the next month, all of the soldiers used to speak of a pretty brothel. easy pick. I will try to get all of my celebrated speed runs on there as well. Um, I was really going to do in the one speedrun episode from the sea and like, maybe bed. one other video to correspond with it. If the right I, think, to any objects, I would just end up sitting on the gates for speedruns for too long. Not so instead, I might just end up just posting it randomly. Because there's quite a few different runs I do. So, I don't know. Just to post them. That way, I'm not sitting on them forever. Check the merchant. And what can I do for you? I have played. These are all songs. They're so expensive. I can buy all of these three, but is it worth it? It's Come just for music. Again. And it only matters when you go to the orchestra. Afford even that much of my time, branded. My mistake. No, mine. Upon reflection, you don't have the scent of a brand. Otto always did know how to please me, more than Sid ever did, anyway. Whoa. Do you think you could please me, Clive? You're the dame. Let us leave such impersonal titles to my less preferred clientele. You. She reminds me of like Isabel. the Assassin's Otto Creed Cortesian. I could trust you. I can trust you, can't I? You With can the head me, Yes, but why would you help you? Because that's what we do. Long ago, Sid did me a kindness when no one else would. I have never forgotten that. Without it, 
I would not be where I am today. And so, I make it a point to do the same whenever possible. Nice. Which brings us here. It's really nice. To the final obstacle between you and whatever it is you seek in the holy capital. Vengeance. Batman. I fear the guards are not likely to let a masterless bearer pass unmolested. Oh, unless I get it. You take unless. me. <laughs> unless, of course, his master deigned to appear. Yes, that will do nicely. I hate this. But... I shall expect a favor in return. She's Wait. using me. What? <sighs> it's okay, Clive. Get it together, bro. You say these are all from Dalmechia? Just let her do whatever she wants to. What the hell are you doing? Tut tut. We cannot uh, have people thinking I tolerate disobedience from my branded. The men who gave me this are no more my masters than you are. But it's not as if I can hide it. From the moment you acquired it, that brand has done naught but take. But don't. today, it is going to give you exactly what you want. Just play along. Madame, back to the vial already. But of course, we must make ready to welcome you, my dear. And who might this be? Why, my new escort. The streets aren't safe for a girl, what with all the royalists about. <laughs> Don't work him too hard. Well, that rather depends on you now, doesn't it? I'll see you all at sunset. Oi, hold up. We want. <laughs> Another fucking branded. Well, you're lucky you're with the dame. Get out of my sight, filth. I feel like this was so extra. For no reason whatsoever. That wasn't so bad. Wasn't so bad. They might have recognized me. But they didn't. And even if they had, they wouldn't have done anything about it. The gentlemen of the garrison are some of my best customers. We have an arrangement. As do you and I. Now, if you'd care to follow me, we can speak more at the Vale. The Doesn't veil. seem like I have much of a choice. What the fuck is the veil? Oh, is that where she's from? Like her building? I haven't seen you Dude, around holy the shit, this is massive. Three floors. And if anyone requests her company, tell them she is feeling unwell. Madame. You look stunning. As, As do always. you, my dear. Shall I have one of the girls draw a bath? That won't be necessary. <laughs> Clive, my darling. She's just fucking Welcome to the Vale. Thank you for seeing me through the gates, my lady. I'm just eating my pizza, don't mind me. Well, that was the whole point, wasn't it? And I told you, it's Isabel. Whatever wound you so tight, I wonder. It's certainly not Sid's influence. You, uh, mentioned a favor. What is it you'd have me do? I don't want to keep my companions waiting. If you mean Sid and the girl, you needn't worry. They have yet to reach the checkpoint. Yes, 
Otto you know. asked me to help them as well. But to answer your question, I need you to find someone for me. One of my girls. Tatienne has been gone for several days now, having left no word of explanation. And I began to fear the worst. I feel as if I've spent my whole life searching for people. No, I can't say I'm any good oh, at it. Bless. I trust you'll do your best. Oh, we go back to rising up Selena. This. Now you want Batman, huh? We can do that evil route. Of that trust. Um, and hope some other time. To keep prying eyes from looking too closely at Dude, the 213's not happening. Face of yours. Now, I have matters to attend to at the I end. ain't gonna learn the jumps, alright? If you find anything, ask for me there. That's pretty much what I decided. I'm not gonna learn it. I'm tired of fucking messing it up. I hate fucking boundary jumps so much. You the bane of my existence. She must trust you. Enough to help me look for one. How's of your problems. hamstring holding up? A woman by the name of Tatien. She's still missing then. You still out cold? Oh, if only I'd comforted her. You saw her before she disappeared. The day before, she was in tears. Uh, She'd lost her comb. In a game, the boundaries are like invisible walls, fancy, right? But you could tell and so this her. uses like a you specific see, spot orphan, on the boundary where like she upon the dame as a you can kind of clip it and all. stand on it. So she was upset. So you, so you pretty much land on it, jump off of it, and then land on to the next part. Someone else did. Tatian shared a room. You have a pit I spider. May have seen something. She's over there, sitting terrifying. by the pond. Thank you. Let's see what her chamber may can tell us then. Uh, let's see what the side quests are. What type of spider do you have? Zero team is well, then, deathly afraid. He's very much afraid of spiders. Excuse me, you there? I cannot help but oh. notice you bear the moon and stars. Fucking theater so skin and shit. you are an associate of the dames? Might I trouble you for some assistance? You'll be rewarded, of course. It's all right. Well, She'll just exactly eat your I'm kneecaps. Oh, you don't have to worry me. about your legs anymore. I am anymore. Etienne, a humble merchant, though fortunate enough to count the days among my acquaintances. I have business beyond tab. these walls, but the guards have grown somewhat suspicious of my comings oh. and goings of late. Like I was hoping tarantula. someone might be kind enough to go in my stead. And who better than someone in the employ of the Vale's proprietor? Would you be willing to help blue a bottle? fellow in his hour of need? Why not? Yeah, I, in the desert where oh, I'm at, tarantulas yes. aren't that the uncommon task is either. Enough. You can get Pass tarantulas the gate here and deliver packages to a few of my most valued clients. There are three in total: a grocer, these can get pretty big though, right? And a distiller. You need only mention that the items you carry are fresh from the master's table. Rock professor, he studied dangerous, I hope. spiders as his like first uh, lab. Why, of course not. Lab class. Uh, merely trifles. And he would go in and like be different, to get different spiders, different on. things, and see how they. And though I cannot prevent you from how that would uh, make them react. That you don't. And of course, you would never put advise. spiders in the same place. Oh, yours is dwarf spider. Four inches. Okay, so that's like the palm of my hand. Yeah, I don't mind spiders all too much. I mean, you kind of need them. Size of small yeah. oh, do they get that color? There's nothing here for your kind, Branded. Go on now. Shoot. I have a delivery from Etienne. Yeah, that sounds about right. Fresh from the master's table. Why didn't you say <laughs> so? <laughs> well, I imagine you really like um, spider stuff. Hard. This here will make them less my mom, I guess both my parents grew up on farms, so spiders are very common for them. Nothing by it. 
Daddy Long Legs specifically. You wait right here. I was never terrified of spiders, but it's yeah. kind of like one of those things. Ah, it's kind of like you why are you here, bro? I'm a man of my word. <laughs> Perfume. This is my house. Oriflam's finest. My Just house, not promised. yours. And then Zero Team runs and screams like no a child. I have business with Branded. Well, I have business with you. A package, fresh from the master's table. I do not know you. Where is the merchant, Etienne? Somewhere the gate guards won't be paying him or his affairs any mind. Fine. Hand over the goods and be gone. Hand over the goods, sure. <laughs> no, I don't put the spider in his bed. He'd probably... Now, mind you... Your team is like Branded, if I just not too you big of a dude, but he's definitely like can built. Take it back. You will do no such so if I thing. did that to him, he would no beat the shit out of me. <laughs> of course, that's when you tell him that you didn't do it. But if you're around, he's gonna beat the shit out. Get out of my sight. Cigars. Those cigars are worth more than your life. <laughs> Do be careful. Oh yeah, problem solved. Just wear a spider suit. I mean, one of them is gonna bite you, and you can become Spider-Man, right? It smells so delightful. Eventually. I warn you now, I don't sell to your kind. Whether you have the coin or not. Where's your master anyway? Etienne sent me. Didn't know he had his own bearer. Business must be booming. All right, quickly now, before the guards notice. I'm just getting some of my videos ready oh, for YouTube. That is no burden off my back. And this is for Etienne. All this for a drink? Not just any drink. The very best. Especially distilled for my most discerning. Customers. How long are you gonna hang out for a while? The guards find that. Yep, at like You'll three hours, and maybe like. You keep it well hidden. All right. Fifteen Ten minutes before zero team shows up. Tell him there's more where that came from. For a prize. Also, we should probably hold, <laughs> not course. talk about spiders when he shows up. Perfume, cigars, and spirits. Some of those expensive tastes. Not the condo for him. <laughs> How can they afford to maintain them? Make his skin crawl. There's only one way to find out. The day done then. I got about like three hours basically. Yeah, overcome your fears. Um, sure, dude. Sure, we can say that. I heard the bones fell favorably. Sergeant's got it in for us, too. Where's I mean, your I have a fear of heights, and he, I have to climb in on the ladder every day at work. Hey, you lost I hate it. Something? I absolutely Sorry, hate it. But the Imperial Guard's got no use for your kind. The infantry always needs more bodies, though. I'm just passing through. But I don't bloody believe it. The bastard's wearing the moon and stars. That'll be why he's strutting about like he owns the place. The dame laughed when we offered her our protection. You reckon this prick's really worth a couple of the Empress I, finest? I also pretty much decided that I'm going to get a camera. I those ways of finding out. How about so I'll do a face man? reveal. Care to show us well. how you earn that brooch? I'd rather not. Oh, no doubt. Only chivalrous souls that we are. Robin and I need to know the dame's being properly looked after. It's not like I have anything to hide anyway. I'm already totally fine with the face reveal. Fine. If it'll put your mind at ease. Oh, and just so you know, I won't be holding back. I suggest you don't either. Take a moment to get ready if you need it. Wouldn't want you whining about an unfair fight. Easy fight. Not worried. 
Now, let's get the measure of you, shall we? If that's what you want. <laughs> Cocky bastard. All right, let's be having you. Leon, huh? I always like the name Leon. Oh, and when you go crying your mistress, tell her it was Leon who gave you the pounding. Use all the dirty tricks you want, Brandon. It's over. Alright. So you know one end of a break from the other. I love the combat. It's so smooth. Fuck me. Fuck me. What the hell are you playing at, Leon? Huh. So it's a real challenge he wants, is it? Fine. Sword up, bearer. Let's have some fun, shall we? How the bearer win the day's favor anyway? I know he went to hold my tongue for a start. Yeah! You've got potential. I give you that. Yeah, stick. Get a little bit more health, but it wasn't that bad. I go now. Gregor's gash. The bastard didn't even break a sweat. The dame's man or no, he's still a branded. Best hope the sergeant never hears about this. I was also using dumb. Not after powers. the bullock he gave us for missing drills. It was a bit cheating. Might be the old side at a point. I'll leave you to it. Yeah, good bloody riddance. <sighs> at least we know the dame's in safe hands, I suppose. Do us a favor. If you have to tell the dame about this, tell her we got a good few hits in, eh? Hmm? I'll talk to you up, sure. That's not like I care about her. 1100. Speak with Tatiana's chambermaid. At the end. You have returned. I believe these are yours. All of them? Dude, he made me really go on this fetch quest. Delightful. The dame will be pleased. You don't say. And would she be pleased to learn what you had to exchange for those items? You mean the crystals? No need to be coy, my boy. Why not just tell me in the first place? An honest man wears deception like shackles about his ankles. I couldn't risk you stumbling under the gaze of the guards. After all, we both know the punishment for dealing in unsanctioned crystals, unsanctioned. even such morsels as I provide. And if you don't know what this day's work may have cost you, then, well, I dare say you'll sleep all the better for it. Despite the risk, our friends beyond the war gladly give their finest and most treasured wares for the paltry crumbs I trade in. I didn't realize crystals were so scarce here. As scarce as chocobo teeth, hence the thriving oh, market. Looks like Zero Team is on. For even the scantest fragments, do you think it vulgar that I profit from the hardship of others? I think you're doing what you believe is necessary. Yeah, indeed. And I don't I imagine he's going to join up as soon as he's done with his intro. A reward for a job well done. I have the goods I was commissioned to gather, and the guards Did he get a the haircut? wiser. I thank you. As will our mutual friend when she hears of how you have aided me.
like, damn, he's got a really long intro. See what he's trying to do here. I think he's joining. He's a resume. Hello. Hello. Hey, hey, hey what's up, dude? <laughs> I know where I fucked up. What do you mean? I know where I fucked up. What happened? Give me a second, everyone. All right, there we go. Hello. What happened? Oh, I forgot to put my head uh, the sound through my headphones. Uh, that's funny, but your mic was on. Well, my mic was on, yeah. I knew my, because that's what it does. My mic's always on, but it never connects my headphones to for sound. I see. Whenever I start up, it starts with my um, TV, my monitor, and then I switch over to controller, and then I have to switch the mic over. So yeah, that's what I was saying. That, that's what I had to do, too. Like, after I switched the headset, then I had to switch it back to this mic, and I'm like, God damn it. Yeah, even when the controller dies, I have to do it again as well. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, so welcome back. You're a little bit later than expected. Well, yeah, fucking. I had to walk all the way from fucking Far Professors. Oh, so, uh, from watching the dog? Yeah, I had to walk all the way from there. And then when I got home, I felt so gross. I was like, dude, I got a shower. <laughs> Did you, like, get a haircut? No. It, that's the thing. It looks like this when my hair is wet. Like, my hair's still not dry yet. What if you, like, try putting it back? Show your forehead. Fine. What do you need me to do? Oh, thank you. An extra meal may not seem like much. But it will make... Okay, that looks more like you. Yeah, no, it's just because that's what I'm saying. It's still wet, that's why. Yeah. So it get so it looks down like that. Oh, it's my bro. natural hair. <laughs> why is this guy turning look emo? <laughs> no, dude, that's what I'm saying. My hair just does that automatically. I was born emo, bro. I was born emo. Born emo. And I shaved my face too real quick. Yeah, I, I see you reflecting off the light. Yeah, I know. <laughs> my pasty ass. What are you drinking there? So, uh, Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper. Be discreet for both yeah. sakes. And for the sake yeah, no, no booze for me. Oh, and when you're finished, you still got good. some bud, though? One of the dame's girls oh, fuck yeah, dude. Want to start with the cheers? Oh, speaking of which, actually, let me grab a... Let me... Let me yeah, I actually got to set it up. I forgot to grab the grinder out of the box, Professor's room. Give me a second. Okay. It's a really long intro. Now, I don't know how long he has until, hopefully he can do this tonight. You know, hopefully the bosses don't force him to do this for a couple hours. Because uh, he will be irritated, that's the case. Luckily it hasn't been too bad, like half an hour for each boss. But I mean that shit can add up. Well, half as much as I need this. Thank you. I don't eat it here though. Okay. Has it always been this bad? Yeah, I brush. Yeah, cause also too, I didn't brush my hair yet, so that's why I'm saying now that I brushed it real quick. It's nice and poofy. Nice and something at least. Uh, where? Where? Oh, where? Where's my work shirt? There we go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But I'll block the logo. Uh, but yeah. fucking my chef, my chef coat for work, dude. It's fucking thick as fuck, dude. Like I found my old, my one when I first started at my job. Oh, really? Like an old one? Yeah. So like this one. I have something for you. Like it's all fucking thick as shit. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's huge. Yeah. Is that what an extra large? No, it's a medium, dude. <laughs> that's a medium. Yeah, dude. Chef coats are just fucking, just insanely huge. Like doesn't matter what the size is, bro. It's just always gonna look big on you, no matter what. 
they wanted to make it this big. Well, it's because of, uh, uh, because for the reason why it's so thick, because of, like, grease and stuff, so it doesn't burn through the fabric and get to you. Interesting. I guess that makes sense. Oil does hurt. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, dude. Fucking, I've dealt with quite a bit of those. Couple of grease burns in my life. Remember one went through because I wasn't wearing oscillops. I was wearing, like, my beat-up bands at the time when I worked at this Irish pub. And, like, fucking one time, like, I accidentally, because, like, it was a rush, and I accidentally, like, pulled out the fucking, the prior rack a little too fast to where all the grease flew, like, a, like all up, and, like, a big splat went right on my foot through the hole, and I had a fucking big-ass grease burn on my fucking right foot for the longest time, dude. It hurt so bad to walk on it. Because it was just boiling, like, yeah, it's just boiled fuck it over. Like, all the skit, dead skin was popping off. Like, like I, like I, it was like, it literally looked like I had a massive cyst on my foot, dude. <laughs> like, it looks so horrid. Yeah. I'm just trying to test things out over here, chat. Don't worry about that. Yeah. Yeah, sorry, everybody. I'm just loading up, setting up. Oh, and that's right. Then the fucking pebble really is in my pants. God damn it. But in your pants. My work is far from us. My work pants. Not the, not the ones I'm wearing right now. You need Obviously. to rest. But I want I wounds to heal and bones to mend. So how late do you think you run hurts? to play for? Probably like tail 10. Cause I get, it, cause I did all my stuff, uh, for the walk-in tomorrow. All right, so we got like, Bro three has more three hours in cattle than the Empire does. Dude, I don't know how he doesn't know. Like, I don't know he was in my room the doing shit. <laughs> frog fucking frog, for, yeah, fucking leaving his fucking wax paper in here. <laughs> It's like, dude, how are you not going to think, like, I'm going to be like, oh, what did I, yeah, oh, just Business. totally forgot, I forgot I took a dab. Even though I don't do that shit anymore. Of all the people, if I was to commit a crime, uh, I don't want to do it with Mark Professor. Then. Just as well. Oh, yeah, dude, too much it, it, lead too much evidence, bro. He'll throw the joint and leave, oh, there's saliva right there, dude. Like, so that's already DNA. DNA. Was a time when he was the vows and then in his shoe, it'll customer. say his home address. He'd be as like, if found. Generous uncle. Return to. He was one of the only people around here who seemed. Nah, I think he got rid of those <laughs> shoes, bro. <laughs> Rare for one in his position. Oh, he just wears not... Crocs now. Not wasted on the dame. A little nudge from. Yeah, dude, all he does is wear his fucking Crocs, bro. He does look Crocs. Dude, it's dude, especially the ones he has, dude. They're all decked out. They got like fucking like mushrooms and like fungi, and the one has frogs on it and all that shit. Gives you faith, though, doesn't it? To know there are people out there like him. And you. So, there we go, Jesus. So I, wonder the I didn't really, really want to do you. your opinion on stream, live on stream. Right. Better be going. Mm -hmm. But it's still kind of a good topic to bring up right now. Mm -hmm. Um, Odiko. What about Have him? you heard about this lately, like the last two days? No, I haven't, kept, I haven't been keeping up with like any YouTubers and shit in a while. They want to cancel him. Why would he do this time? He, um, well, it goes back from an old, old article with Tana, Tana Mojo, whatever. So the new yeah. The girls have been talking about. Apparently, he did, and you've did been some essay. Errand, eh? Poor boy. You'll be knackered before the real work begins later on tonight. Oh, I know what you're talking yeah, about. It's, it's an old shit, but it's coming back and it's saying, and the people are saying that he's just been. Before. Um, sweeping under the rug for too long, and you can't keep getting away with it. Dude. <laughs> now, okay, I, dude. Yeah. Don't try to defend. Garrison. Don't try to defend. Okay. First yeah. and foremost, well, I don't want you to be yeah. Either way, bro, like, do you know I think... about the Tana Mojo incident? Yeah, I do know a little bit of it. Not a whole lot, but I know, like, a summary of it, I guess. Yeah, because, I mean, it's an old thing. The dame was so proud yeah. This isn't like the first time it's been brought up, but it's being re-brought up. This man from the yeah. 
Did you ever see him? But I don't like all I really wanted to, he tried to, sneak say into our room to get your kind of see what you wanted to say, on. but I mean, I didn't really want to do it live on stream. Like, yeah, don't no, defend yeah. the guy because you don't know. We both don't know. Well, that's what I was saying. Yeah, it was like, but either way, I think people will just jump to conclusions a lot as well. Like, you know, they need, you know, we need a little more evidence first before we can even defend or make us statement against him you know yeah all we have currently are some really old clips that point toward Odiko being the the main dude mm -hmm. and uh, the old ass clip of Tana Mojo yeah but also as well too dude like it, people take his shit out of context all the time apparently like there's a like side for Cody which is probably the side that you're on mm -hmm. which is like this isn't new like, for a everyone fucking this hates Tana. Who cares about Tana to begin with? Mm -hmm. and, that's, and that's my first thought. Is it, I, I could care less. But yeah. Like about Tana. But I mean, the conduct itself is is gone too far. You know. Yeah, and I, I, you know, I could agree in that sense. You know. But if it's true. Yeah, if it's true. Said he had dealings with a merchant there. But, you know, but Tana is also known to, like, blow the horn a little, you know, too soon a couple times before. And there's been cases of that. Yeah, um, which is why no one's really cared much for it right now. Until... Yeah, like when everybody was on the... Uh, especially with her and what was Jeff Jeff Whittick or whatever his name is. Oh, Jeff like they were when yeah when they were on the the hate train for David Dobrik trying to cancel him too and all that shit. Yeah, apparently there's also a clip of H three H three bringing this up, which is another kind of semi hated person. Mm hmm. Yeah. And like, but that's the thing with H three. But he H three switched sides so fast. That was the thing with him though. Like he. Because of Leafy, I don't care about H3. The soldiers I spoke to believe. Well, yeah, that, but also, too, like, ever since he's been doing his podcast, like, his attitude and, like, his morales, like, what he's done with YouTube and, like, what he said in the past has completely changed now. Like, he's literally became everything he always talked about in the past that he hated. Like, he, he always talked about, like, shit on Trisha Paytas, blah, blah, blah. Never liked her and all this stuff. Always, like, gave her a hard time. Now and then he makes a fucking podcast with her. Which was like a joke on their there hatred toward each other. Yeah, but it, it that was it. Somewhat seems staged. Yeah, because like either way, because he even said too, he's like, no, like we're actually like really good friends because he's married, because she's ma like close to getting married to my wife's brother. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? She has like been around work. She definitely has done a lot. Oh yeah, dude. She's she's done it all, man. It's crazy. Like, yeah. How old is Trisha? Do you know? Come on, see it tonight. She's got to be in her thirties, bro. No way, that was young. Yeah, she's not at forty. I know that, but she's still in her thirties. She's probably in her late thirties. Damn, dude, that's not too old. No, dude, she's not. Like, cause I know her. How old is? The, name, uh, the one dude that was full. dated, then the older guy. Oh, oh, um. The dated Trisha. Yeah, that, uh, fuck, well, I keep forgetting his name. But he was like, he's in his 50s, dude. He's like 50. He's old. Okay. Yeah, he was like, at that point, he had to be like in his like late 40s, early 50s. Yeah, dude, but no, but no, but that guy uh, sal settled down now. He fucking, uh, he's got a way hotter wife. Like, damn, dude. Like, I can't believe that fucking dude can pull, bro. See, Perks is staying with David for so long, dude. Like, shit went right with him. He, he, he milked the right cow. So the whole reason why this is being brought up is because mm. um, a really famous uh, reporter that's on the YouTube stage. And usually he like make is it, is it, was it Andrew? And Andrew Collier. No, I would have said his name. I mean, dude, I was saying, oh, that was crazy, dude. He, I was like, him and Cody are friends too, and he's like reporting <laughs> against his own friend. Well, the thing is, Cody, you know, he's been around. 
you know? see they've sent me a for a long time. Yeah, so like everybody kind of knows him. And do you know what's funny too? That when they brought this up now, they do it right after he came. They came out with the real Bros of Simi Valley movie. Isn't that funny coincidence? <laughs> it is. Uh, what is his name? D'Angelo Wallace. Oh, that guy. And he covers a lot of the shit. Yeah. And so most people, he does like very like deep dive stuff. Yeah, but he's kind of. But for me, he's like a he's like a gossip channel, you know, like. I mean, it is. I mean, at this point right now, it is gossip. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. These are allegations. We don't know if it's true. True, yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's, there's no proof of him being like, oh, you actually did do this. It's just hearsay. Yeah, it is. Yeah, and that's why he's like, you shouldn't take this to full account unless we know the facts. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, people, they just jump to the conclusion nowadays. Like, you know, they don't bother to check the facts and deep dive into it like everyone else does they're yeah. just like oh okay he's a piece of shit like all right everybody get rid of him <laughs> and the same goes for people who jump to defend yeah in both ways you know you gotta play neutral yeah you can't be biased about it like you know like for me i hope it's not true but you know if it is well fuck man like you should have you know not been such a piece of shit it's true what is this? Shit. Yeah, so because, attacked. like, it's like a decade ago. That's what I'm saying, dude. It's such a long time ago, too. Like, I understand, like, if it, if it was a serious thing, like, and he actually been finding way... Because, like, how long have people been trying to, like, still bring this up and, like, try to get him, like, fucked for it? That's the thing. So the incident happened when Cody was 25. Yeah, okay. How old is he at now? Do you know? He's got to be, he's got to be like 35. He's, so it was 10 years ago, so he's 35 now. I don't know if it was a death. Someone needs to put an end to this. Yeah, but I'm saying if it was, he was, he's like 35, 36 now, I think. And now he's married, has a kid. Yeah, married, has a kid, has shit. See, this is, cause that's the thing too, what a lot of people like to do. When somebody ends up going right in their life, like a little too right, people are like, oh, okay, now we got to dig up dirt against him. Well, like, an another thing is, um, what D'Angelo is saying is he's been sweeping it under the rug for too long. He's been hangwalling this by hiding it from media. He should just let it be known at this point. Was yeah, that's true. Because the more you, look exactly, the more you try to hide it, bro. Like the more they're like, okay, you really did something. Like, mm -hmm. like if you're trying, yeah, just yeah, exactly. Just like address it, bro. Like if you really did do anything. Okay, so he's 33. Yeah, he's 33 years old. So it happened seven, eight years ago. He talks too much. Yeah, it's not right. I don't like him, father. You're not the branded I bought. So. How dare you deceive me? But yeah, but I don't know, man. Like, like I said, yeah, we we gotta we gotta wait till like we get more of the facts to like make our opinions about it. I mean, I'll, I'll watch you. I'll watch uh, the video with you. The one mm. that I watched. It's pretty um damning, but it's yeah, not but like concrete. It's again, it's hearsay between two different girls. It, two exactly. Different but either way, because as a fan, I hope. I hope Cody didn't do this. I hope he didn't commit such atrocities. <laughs> I'm my own master. I'm beholden to no one. We just hope and pray. And I take orders. Yeah, dude, because, like, bro, like, out of everybody, like, on YouTube and stuff that I commit, like, I have followed, like, my whole life. I've, like, known YouTube and all that. It's been Cody. The whole fucking time, dude, when he made vines, when he did little skits, like. They felt fear and pain, just as you yeah. do. I followed that man all the way through, dude. Watched the first episode of TMG, the first time it came out. And you're not the first, and you're definitely not the only. Yeah, that's true. How dare you? It does. Yeah, because we would lose, like, a really big known's name. But, you know, time will tell. With Jaws powerful enough to nip this branded's head. That's all I want. I just want to bring that up. It was something that I thought about yesterday because the news came out a couple of days ago. Yeah.
That's still crazy though. <laughs> I'm wasting my time. So fucking. All right, take a take a negative cheers. Negative cheers. <laughs> they deserve a proper burial. Yo, speaking uh, of cancel people, Atriox just went live. 